Right, Austin, um, firstly, what is uh, the, the feeling on the street in Cairo this morning following uh, last night's uh, riots? Well, there's a lot of anger, definitely. Um, there's different theories going around as to uh, what exactly was the spark of the violence. Some people are saying that there was a deliberate um, attempt to expose the Al-Ahli fans to uh, the uh, anger of the, the Al-Masri fans from Port Said. Um, and that is uh, relevant because uh, the Ahli fans have actually been like the, 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 have been a major force on the street in terms of uh, con confrontations with the police here in Cairo. And um, interestingly as well, today is the anniversary of the famous, what's called the Battle of the Camel, when um, uh, the square was attacked by men on horse and camelback. Um, and so we were already expecting a large turnout in terms of protesters today, but now it seems like it's, it's, it's brewing into a really um, a big day here in Cairo. Uh, there's uh, marches forming in various neighborhoods. There was a march of around 1,000 people um, just down the road from where I am now, uh, which is a normally quiet suburb of, of Cairo. Uh, there's um, the train carrying uh, people back, the Ahli fans back from Port Said was greeted by a huge crowd. So the spirits are very high and it's um, very unpredictable where today could go. In particular, there's an idea that Ahli fans might march to the Minister, Ministry of the Interior, um, which would be a replay of scenes that happened during the revolution and during the uh, November clashes where uh, that, the streets between Tahrir and the uh, Interior Ministry became a battleground. If, how will the interior ministry react? It's very hard to tell. They've, um, the, the, the whole uh, situation, some say, rather than being a conspiracy brought on by the police, is actually a result of the police being um, intimidated out of doing their jobs by the fact that they've been so, so roundly beaten again and again by, uh, some of, you know, the, by mobs of angry young men that they don't want, they didn't stand and uh, didn't want to get in the way. And that might happen again today. They may retreat. The army may be deployed in their, in place to defend the Ministry of the Interior. That's a very likely scenario. Um, but with growing anger at the military, it's hard to see uh, that being a completely smooth process as well. There's a, there's a lot of possibility for things to spiral out of control here today. Thank you very much, Austin. Uh, Austin Mackel in Cairo. We will come back to you if there's any more. Thank you.